So you're thinking of moving to Las Vegas, Nevada? More specifically, Summerlin? But you're concerned it may be out of your budget. Well, then this video is for you because we're gonna be discussing and visiting five affordable neighborhoods that do not get mentioned very often when Summerlin is brought up. And we're gonna get after it right now. If you are new to this channel and you want to know everything there is to know about eating, sleeping, working, playing the good and the bad about living in Las Vegas and the surrounding areas, then subscribe below and tap the bell for notifications so you can be the very first to know about the current market here in Las Vegas. Hi, my name is Mark Pepe and the team and I get calls and emails every day from people just like you looking for help on making their move to Las Vegas. We are passionate about removing the stress of relocating to a completely new city and state. Whether you're moving in nine days or 90 days, give us a call, choose a text, send us an email, and we'll be more than happy to help you make a smooth move to Las Vegas. It's no secret, Summerlin is one of the most desirable places to live in all of the Las Vegas Valley. The award-winning master plan community offers something for everyone as it relates to real estate. From custom multi-million dollar homes and golf course communities to 55 plus communities, townhomes and condos. However, the premium location of Summerlin also comes with the highest price point of homes as well. But did you know there are other neighborhoods in Summerlin that fall more in line with other suburbs in the Las Vegas Valley? Yes, it is true. The five villages and communities we are about to go visit often get overshadowed by the grander villages of the Paseos, the Ridges, or the Mesa, but still offer an incredible location at an affordable price point. So without further ado, let's go visit them. Our first stop is in Summerlin Center. This village started development in 1997 and consists of 1,004 mixed-use acres and over 1,400 single and multi-family homes in the heart of the master plan, located directly above Red Rock Country Club and below the Summerlin villages of the Vistas and Paseos. There are five major office and retail centers, three schools and a community park. While residing in this community puts you within minutes from dining, shopping, and entertainment at downtown Summerlin. These centers include major retailers like Costco, Best Buy, and Lowe's. You know, when it comes to housing options, there are a variety of single family homes in track and gated neighborhoods to urban luxury townhomes and condominiums in affinity. Condos in Summerlin Center start around $350,000 while townhomes start around $430,000 and single family homes start around $450,000. If you want to be in the middle of all the action that Summerlin has to offer, then this village is the place to live. So let's go take a quick drive around this community and see what you think about it. Our next village is Sun City Summerlin, one of the largest 55 plus communities in all of Nevada with over 12,500 residents and can be found at the northern border of Summerlin at an elevation offering tree-lined streets and breathtaking views of the valley and surrounding Red Rock Canyon. This Del Webb retirement community started development in 1989 and was completed in 1999. It offers four different clubhouses, each with a wide range of amenities, including a fitness center, three golf courses, and over 80 different groups to join, and plenty of walking and biking trails. Residents also enjoy many popular theatrical and musical performances, as well as movies and guest speakers. There really is no shortage of things to do here in Sun City Summerlin. 
What also makes the list uh, as an affordable neighborhood is that the, the townhomes start around $300,000, while single family homes start at $350,000, which again for Summerlin is an outstanding value. This community is located just 20 minutes from the Las Vegas Strip. The prime location also puts you in close proximity to all of your daily conveniences. There are grocery stores such as Albertsons, Smith's, there's a Walmart and Sprouts Farmer's Market just minutes away. Pharmacy needs can be met at Walgreens and CVS as well. The community is also close to several healthcare providers such as Harbor Island Medical Center, Rainbow Medical Center, and Mountain View Hospital. So plenty of healthcare options as well. This is a wonderful retirement community with so much to offer active adult homeowners. So let's go take a drive around this village and get a feel for it. Our next stop is in the village of the Arbors. Also located in Summerlin North, just east of the 215 Beltway, the Arbors is one of the largest villages in the master plan on 1,206 acres, made up of 30 different neighborhoods. One of them is located right over here across from the park here. Development started in the late 1990s through the early 2000s on an elevated topography offering great views of the Las Vegas Valley. As a resident of the Arbors, you get to enjoy several parks, one of them located right here behind me. There's also well-equipped schools, golf courses, close-by shopping areas, health centers, and recreation centers. One of the most popular amenities in the, is the Arbors Tennis and Play Park, which is home to the Summerlin Tennis Club, located here right behind me as well. This is such a great central location uh, within Summerlin. Among the many subdivisions are Fallbrook and Cottonwood Terrace, two of the more affordable places to live in this Summerlin Village. Fallbrook offers resident single family homes that start around 440,000, while the Cottonwood Terrace offers townhomes that start around 400,000. So again, really affordable priced homes in Summerlin. So let's go jump back in the car and see what this village has to offer. Our next stop is in the village of The Crossing. Situated in Summerlin North and measuring 530 acres, this mixed use village that started development in 1994 is one of Summerlin's largest commercial areas, including the state-of-the-art Summerlin Hospital Medical Center, you've got Le Cordon Bleu College of Culinary Arts, and offices of Expedia.com. It's also home to The Crossing Business Center, which covers 110 acres with nearly 1.2 million square feet of office space. There is also an abundance of amenities, including award-winning schools and parks. You will find a wide variety of real estate options here, from condos to townhomes and single family homes in 12 different neighborhoods, a number of which are gated. Amongst the more affordable neighborhoods is Pacific Crest and Red Bluffs, both featuring condominiums that start around $275,000. Sunset Mesa is a gated townhome community that offers between two and four bedrooms that starts around $390,000. So if you're looking to live close to the corporate epicenter of Summerlin, this village may be a great fit for you. So let's go check it out. Last but not least, we are here in the village of the Pueblo, the second oldest village in Summerlin, developed in 1992 with the distinctive Pueblo-style architecture, hence the name of the village. It is also located in Summerlin North, 
but is Summerlin's easternmost village positioned along Lake Mead Boulevard with convenient access to Summerlin Parkway, which makes getting around town very, very easy. It also offers some of the more affordable Summerlin condos and townhomes on 568 acres. With more established neighborhoods come yards that are well kept with lush landscaping, something that is not common across the Las Vegas Valley, including here in Summerlin. Buena Vista is a community with affordable two and three bedroom townhomes that start around $330,000. Then you have La Posada is a gated community featuring a main level and second level condominium living that can be found starting around $250,000, while single family homes start at $450,000. So again, very, very affordable and reasonably priced homes here in Summerlin. This village features a 34,000 square foot retail center, private and public schools, and a 60,000 square foot medical facility. You don't have to go very far at all for all of your daily necessities. Residents have access to the 62 acre Pueblo Park here right behind me. It is one of Las Vegas's best kept secrets, which is a linear park stretching almost the entire length of the community that provides phenomenal views of the Las Vegas Valley and offers trails and paths, including the 3.7 mile Pueblo Trail to walk, jog, and bike. There's also a desert garden, green space, a children's play areas, and basketball courts. This is a great family community with something to offer everyone. So let's go take a drive around and see what you think about this village. Well, this gives you a good overview of the top five most affordable neighborhoods in Summerlin. See, I told you there's some reasonably priced real estate here. I'm curious, which village is your favorite? Let me know in the comments here below. It's not by mistake, this master plan community is one of the most desirable places to live, not only in Southern Nevada, but in the entire country. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it informative. So please like and share this video. Please subscribe below and comment if you have any questions or found this video helpful. Also, be sure to check out our other videos on the surrounding areas so you can continue to get a realistic sense of what it would feel like to live here in the Las Vegas Valley. So whether you are moving in nine days or 90 days, give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email, or even schedule a Zoom appointment here in the description below. We can't wait to help you make a smooth and stress-free move to Summerlin. So until next time, we hope to show you around town very, very soon.